It's week 34, and if you're having multiples, this could be your delivery week. And if you're not, you're still probably about six weeks away. Now would be a great time to contact your insurance company and make sure baby is covered. Baby isn't changing much these days. He's just patiently hanging out, growing stronger and bigger every day. He's measuring close to 17 and a half inches long and weighs over five pounds. However, at this point, the size and weight estimate really varies from baby to baby. By week 34, baby may start to move into birthing position. This means that it'll turn head down, facing the back, and drop into the birthing canal. Although for first-time moms, this usually happens about three weeks before delivery date, and the change will be noticeable. You'll see baby resting lower in your abdomen, which will make it easier to breathe, but you'll also have to run to the bathroom a whole lot more because baby will be sitting right on your bladder. If you're planning to breastfeed baby once he's here, use this week to talk to other mothers about a lactation consultant. Breastfeeding is natural, but it's not always easy. Many hospitals have lactation professionals on staff to help you and baby learn proper latching techniques, which can be key to breastfeeding successfully. Also, it's important to remain positive, which leads me to my next point. You have a nice, neat birthing plan in place, right? And you're just waiting to put it into action? If that's the case, great but give yourself permission to be flexible in case the unexpected occurs. An open mind will allow you to respond rather than react. And you can find helpful advice on keeping an open mind at everydayfamily.com.